Hi guys. Okay, I know it's been a while since I've been on this channel. I'm so sorry. Forgive me. I've been uh, busy or just trying to hurry up and get something done and I have not been over here with you guys. So I'm here today and I'm going to be doing, I'm wearing a shawl because it's cold outside and I'm wearing this velvet looking shirt and some khaki color jeans and some boots because it's freezing outside today. So this is like one of those wrap shawls that look bougie. So I've already done, um, you know, my foundation and things like that. I'm going to go into my eyeshadow look since that is the most important part. And I'm going to be using my I Bring Nothing to the Table eyeshadow palette. Um, That's the one you saw. So I'm going to be using that palette today. My Thanksgiving was wonderful. How was yours? <laughs> yes. I didn't gain one pound. I feel so wonderful. And that's what I like. We don't gain weight during the holidays. <laughs> hey. <clears throat> he was just thinking about my makeup. I thank you, Kelly. You know, uh, these make those palettes make good Christmas gifts too. I'm just putting on my primer before I start my eyeshadow, y'all. So give me a second. So it can stick real good. Okay, now that that primer is on, I'm good. All right, let me scoot y'all up. <clears throat> no weight, you didn't gain weight either. Good. You got a snowstorm at the gym? God is, oh my goodness. All right, so going into my I Bring Nothing to the Table palette. First, I got to start off with a neutral color. So I'm going to go in here. It's like a cream beige, a cream color. Just going to hit my lid with that to get everything able to be blended well. Um, there's a darker color as well, uh, as so that every skin tone can have that nude or cream eye base. Yes, okay, so no weight gain. <laughs> Do I have level up primer? Not yet. It's coming though. It's going to be here one day. That is on my list, baby. But I do have something coming up very soon. Something new. Okay, so um, for my transition color, since I am wearing browns and reds and, and creams and stuff today, I'm going to go in with something um, on this row. I'm trying to figure if I should go dark or light. I'm going to go in the middle. This is an orangey color, almost like a pumpkin orange. And let's see how that, ooh, I used to be pigmented. So it is a pumpkin-y orange, but it's going to make a good transition color because I'm going to use some uh, um, satin on the lid and some really nice highlight. So this will make a good transition. So I'm just getting that in with like a fluffy brush. I'm gonna go ahead and do a crease color too. Ooh, I, got it. I went in the wrong color. I'm gonna have a, one orange eye, one super orange. You got your magnetic lashes. Everyone love them. Oh, I'm so happy, Christy. Yes, I love those lashes. Oh my gosh. Um, they stay on well, especially if you if you put them on when the uh, the liner, the magnetic liner is still wet. It stays on all day. Okay. 
now I got that down. I'm going to lay down my lid color. Now I want something pretty, but not too bold. So this really pretty, it's almost like a rose gold, a light rose gold. If you just lay that down, you see that? It's so pretty. Uh, you can go darker if you want. I have like this pretty gold. Right? I might mix it because I think I want a little bit darker. Uh -huh. You still trying to learn the eyeshadow basics? Well, I I have those steps like, you know, primer, nude color all over. Then I do the transition and then I do the lid and then I do the art, the um, highlight and then maybe under eye. So I'm just mixing these two colors, this rose gold and this really pretty gold color right here for my lids. And this is a little cheap brush I got from the Dollar Tree by Wet n Wild. Cause I just throw stuff away and get little cheap brushes cause I, I don't like washing brushes. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't. If I do, it's an expensive brush or a brush that I really like, like this one. I'll wash that one, but not the little ones. I'll just throw them away. How are y'all? Okay, so this is the look so far. I'm gonna go in with a crease color. And for a crease color with this look, you can either go bold or barely anything. I think, um, and also their glitters down here are really good for the holidays. I'm not gonna do any glitter today because I'm not really trying to bling bling like that. But I think I'm gonna go into this color right here for my crease color. It's a brownish, um, it's a brownish color that's kind of got a little bit of red in it. So it looks like that, see? So it's not too much, but it gives you some depth and definition. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see. Hey. How are we doing? I sell brushes too, y'all. I think I have the set of Sprinkle Sprinkle brushes. They come with seven brushes, I believe. Um, so y'all can check that out. I have the the whole level up makeup kit that you can get. It's, it comes with six items. You get brushes, lashes, lash glue, this palette. You get a, a, a liquid lipstick in the number 10 color, which is a hot pink. And you get, um, a, did I say level up lashes and glue? And then you get that bronze uh, Bahama Mama, I mean a Bahama Mama. I'm thinking about alcohol, but I don't even drink anymore. The Bahama, uh, Bahamian Goddess uh, highlighter as well. So it's a good deal because you get all that stuff in one. So I'm just going into this crease with the same color and I'm gonna blend it. I'm just trying to get that color in there real good so I can blend it. And you woke up at 5.30, took a shower, and was going to put on makeup, but I felt 6 a.m. was too early to put on makeup. <laughs> it's not when you have to be somewhere at 7 or 8. That's never too early, girl. Unless you don't have anywhere to go. <laughs> then you can wait. Okay, so this is, a, this is looking really natural today, but it's still put together, you know. I like it. Now I gotta get this highlight color. So I have all these up here I could do a highlight with. Here's one of my sprinkle sprinkle brushes, y'all. So I think I'm gonna use this. This one up here is really sparkly. It's like a champagne color. I'm just gonna hit that brow bone. Uh, do I have Cyber Monday deals? I did actually drop the prices last week. Um, <laughs> 
I dropped a lot of the prices last week. So, especially on the, uh, look at the palettes. I might go and drop another price after this video. We'll see. For Cyber Monday. Okay. Okay, so I'll have that down. Then if you want to get those cure ducts, uh, go get them. <laughs> uh-huh. This is my palette. Yes, I bring nothing to the table. Yeah, yeah. Um, so... There we go. Now, if you want like a deeper look, you could go in for darker. There's a black here, and you can do liner with the black. You can enhance that crease with that black, but I don't want to do that today. Um, something wrong. Okay, so I think I do need a little bit more. Crease color, but not blend it out. So I'm going to add a little bit more crease color back. I think I'm going to try. Oh, that's the wrong. That's the wrong one. I think I'm going to try. Well, that's yeah. I'm going to go back into that color and just not blend it so much and just get it in the corner right there. So it has that depth. I thought, oh yeah, that's perfect. And I don't want to blend that because it's already kind of blended at the top. All right. I'm going to blend the top, though, to get. I'm not using a mirror. I'm using a camera. I'm talented. I'm not even using a mirror. All right. It's a natural look. It's a natural. But I like that highlighted look on that brow bone. It just makes you look bright and healthy. Okay, so that's my look. I'm gonna go under it with uh, maybe the black. Maybe I'll go under it with the black liner just a little bit, which I'll think it was easy, right? I'm trying to do easy looks some, sometimes, and then sometimes I go all out and do like. A lot, but today I'm not feeling like doing too much. So I'm just going into this black and hitting that lash line just to give it some more depth. Done with that. Um, now for the liner. Now liner is tricky. I always get stuck on this, but. It is what it is. I'm gonna be using my tartiest liquid pen liner. And I'm gonna to have to use a mirror for this. Cause now I don't know if I want a extra lift today, but when I do my extra lift, I gotta go like this. I gotta go. What am I doing today? My makeup right now. You want that, that palette? It's available. It's the first link. In the description bar where it says show more down there it is available yeah okay i'm gonna i have to go i have to go like this to draw my angle that's a different angle you see and i need to do it on the other side at the same time because sometimes i mess up Still messed up. Let me see. Close enough though, right? Let me do it again. <laughs> it's still like I always get it off. I think because the eyes are a little bit off different. Okay. Thank you. Now that I've got that line down. 
We just went in and went like that. Made a triangle. I have to fill in that triangle. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. There. <laughs> it's cute, I guess. Oh, it's not what I really wanted, but it's good enough. I'm bring this light in closer. So I'm good with that. And I just go in, do a little stroke to get it even with the rest. Ta da! Now this side is not going to be the same, I know it, but I'm fine. I wish me luck. It's exciting, isn't it? You never know what's going to happen. This liner. All right, so. Don't look like it came out exactly the same, but hey, I'll make it work. When you put those lashes on, you can't really tell anyway. Ha ha. Hmm. I'm gonna do this thicker right here because I did that thicker here. Plus, when I put the lashes on, it's not gonna really matter. So, this one is less slanted than this one. So, that I know what the problem is. I have to bring this wing out and it has to be less curved. So, I gotta get my makeup remover. And keep it together. Okay. Mm. Guess that works. Kind of. All right, let's get these lashes off. But first, I got to do um, my mascara. The Too Faced Holiday Better Than Sex Mini Mascara. Uh, I think I had a little bit on already, but just to get that bottom lash line, I killed it with my Christmas wish list and on my Amazon wish list. <laughs> I need to start linking that. I don't really need anything for Christmas, but um, there's stuff that I would would like. Okay, let's get this lash on. So I'm gonna go in with my magnetic lashes, which are also for sale on my Poshmark. These are very bold. <sighs> let's get them on, shall we? Okay, let me see which one. What do you think? Yes. Yes. Okay, thank you. Anyway. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm just putting this liner on for the magnetic lashes. I put it on thick. And then I put it on also on my lashes a little bit right by the crease and see how these have little magnets that just stick right to it and you have to get it on while it's wet. It sticks, the magnets work better when the liner is wet. So get it on while it's wet. <laughs> Okay. 
make sure the magnet is on that liner for best results. Okay. Try to get as close to the lash line as possible. And there you go. I think I got some of my eyeball, but some of that liner on my eyeball. <laughs> but hey, that happens. Okay. Happy with that result. Marcus is in here this early. Goodness gracious, Marcus. How you doing? Where to work? Okay. You say yours will get stuck to the refrigerator? Probably. At least you would know where they were. Some people be losing their life when they take them off, just stick them on the fridge. <laughs> right? Uh oh, that point in the corner. Okay, so. This is what the liner looks like. I'm just going to paint this on. It is black. So if it helps, if you already have one liner and you don't have to worry about. Mixing it up. Oh. Okay, now I gotta lay this one down. Close to that lash line. And I think I'm I think I'm good. Okay. Done. Okay, now for a little contour. Then I think I'm almost done. I don't, I have to do blush and then a little bit more highlight. Okay, so my contour, I use this Ulta contour palette. And I just go down a little bit like this, not too much, just enough to show up on camera. Because in real life, you know, if, when people over contour <laughs> and it looks fake. So I think a less is more, just blend it out. Yeah, this is more. All right, in that area. Okay, now I'm going to do a little contour. I already have some on, but I'm gonna do a little bit more. Cause I'm gonna blend this out. And I might have worn off in the way, <laughs> along the way. Okay, so let me blend this in a little bit. Okay. Now for my highlighter. Now this is my favorite highlighter. It's my highlighter by Level Up Cosmetics. It's the one that comes in the Level Up kit. It is in Bahamian Goddess, and um, where is my highlighter brush? Oh, it's hiding from me. Oh, well, I'll use this one for now for my nose. So I just get a little bit and stick it here and here. Uh huh. For a little highlight. Now I'm gonna get on my my cheeks that's the one i'm looking for but i can't find it i have to use this one this will work i still need to do my blush i totally forgot so i like it because it matches my skin tone perfectly it just gives like a natural glow it doesn't look like you know, you try it too hard, she's like, that's my skin. Uh, this is my skin. Yes. Um, OK, 
Okay, so I'm gonna be going to this Narciss Narcissus Wanted Two palette. Since I have on like orangish colors today, I'm gonna mix these two, like this pretty mauve and this orangey color. I'm just gonna hit my apples. And these have a little bit of sheen in it, especially this one. This is by NARS. I'm just gonna hit that a little bit. Not too much. You know, I'm gonna I'm blend I'm gonna blend it anyway. So mm. Marcus said he a software engineer and he will into six figures. Don't brag on but he don't brag on YouTube. Hey Marcus, I know. Said he's a software engineer. Ooh. Well, into six figures. That's wonderful, Marcus. Wonderful. He says he's not a dusty. Nars blush does not show on your skin. You gotta go to the other colors. Look, these colors right here will show up. I promise you. Look, that's gonna show up. This gonna show up. You gotta get this palette. It's the wanted two. This one might not show up. But those do. Oh, I'll swatch the other colors for y'all who are curious. I mean, how am I gonna just swatch three, right? That color. That color. This is more of a highlight. You can use this one as a highlight. So, that's the Narcissus Wanted Two palette. It shows up. <laughs> There you go. <sighs> yeah, I'll give the markets a hard time. <laughs> anyway. So, I'm a little ponytail going today. I don't know what I want to do with this hair. Um, so, now for lips. What color? Nude, red. Should I go dark red? How can you purchase the palette by itself? It comes by itself. Just scroll down on my Poshmark and you'll see it. And it's just it just looks like this on the picture by itself. Okay. Red, pink, red, red, red. I'm gonna use one of my level up reds. So should I do ready to scam or she red? Ready to scam is the darker red, it's more deep. And a she red is a lighter red. So, dark or light red? Deep red, dark red, dark red, ombre. Ombre. She said ombre. I might do that. Let's see what ombre looks like. I'll do the dark on the outside and light on the inside. Okay. So, Let's just see how the dark looks first. And then if it needs to be brightened, I'll put that she red. This one is ready to scam. This is on my Poshmark too. Okay. This is what it looks like. Um, Y'all think I should do the ombre? Now that you see. Ombre, ombre. I'm doing the ombre. That looks pretty. Yeah, y'all. You bought two lipsticks. They should be here any day now. I'm so happy. Yes, I'm. I had to go to the post after the post office after this video and drop off your orders. 
if y'all ordered over the weekend, I'm dropping them off. All right. Thank you. So, let me make sure it looks straight. It's, a, it's like a matte cream. So, I like it. I like it. I like it. Now I gotta spray my face. Am I done? Am I done? I gotta spray. I'm using this um, Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. It works really good. So, I got that at Ulta by Morphe. And I'll just pat it down. Wait, fan myself. There we go. I love the post office look. It's not really a post office. It's one of those postal uh, stores where you can go in and just drop your stuff off and buy stuff. And it's less crowded than a post office. You know, those local posts place. I like those better because it's less. My I bring nothing to the table palette. My she read and my ready to scan. I used my Level Up Highlighter in Bahamian Goddess for the highlight. And my Magnetic Level Up Lashes. So, that's my look. And I used, I also have the eye pencil as well. If y'all are looking for an eyebrow pencil, I also have those available. And um, they they come in different colors, so you can pick the color that you want. It comes in dark brown, brown, black, light brown. And I also sell um, regular lashes with lash glue. You all can check all of that out. Um, so here's my level up pencil, but it has two um, tops on it. And that's what it looks like. It, it's shaped just like the Anastasia slanted brow and it has a spoolie on the other end as well so with the lid on it but i lost the lid so mm -hmm. if i were looking at celebs and you were single who would you be who would be the type you'd recommend celebs which one got the most money baby that's the one <laughs> I'm going for I'm going for the ones with the money. I don't even care what they look like. But if I had to go by looks, if I had to go by looks, I like them older though. See, I like them older. Chris Brown, look, are you crazy? I know you lying. Nope, nope, nope. Y'all said, you said Chris Brown, you said Brad Pitt. I'm going for T'Challa. I know he's not older. We're about the same age, but I'm going for T'Challa. Chadwick. Come on, Chadwick. Let's go, Chadwick. <laughs> okay. I'll take me some T'Challa. Am I 30? Girl, I'm not 30. But thank you. And me and to me and Chadwick are about the same age, baby. That's the closest. <laughs> Wakanda forever. <laughs> if I had to go for looks, I'll, I'll go for a look. He's he's single? Are we? I'm going to tell Sasha. Sasha want him too, girl. I said, by the time you get of age, he's going to be old man. But that might be perfect. That might be perfect. <laughs> um, how do I control oily skin with my makeup in the summer without caking on, without caking on powder? 
You should get like some of those uh, blotting tissues. They're like these little blotting papers that they sell them at the cosmetic stores. They sell them everywhere, basically. And you just blot the oil off with the paper. Or you could just use like, um, a lot of people just use like paper towel. But you get the blotting papers and you blot the oil off. And it soaks it up. Mm -hmm. Some people use like rice powder as well. And so someone says put powder under your foundation. That's a good idea. Mm -hmm. So I guess I'm done, y'all. The ungodly things I'll do to it just up. <laughs> y'all are so silly. Thank you, ladies. Oh, who who do y'all want? So I see Jeff Bezos, I see Idris, I see I saw Chris Brown, I saw Brad Pitt. Who else? Who's your crush? Who's your celeb crush? Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna go drop my stuff and then I'll be back to do videos. Elon Musk. Okay, Brad Pitt. Y'all have the same ones. Hmm. Or is that like a repeat? The Rock. Oh, yeah, I forgot about The Rock. Yeah. How could I forget about The Rock? The Rock was, The Rock, The Rock is is up there, too. He's number two. He was number one, but now he's number two. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, Jason Momoa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He could be number three. He could be number three. Did my nose makeup. Oh. Did you say check my nose makeup? Okay. I'm going to check it. <laughs> Jesse Williams. Nope. Samuel Jackson. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> that's funny all right y'all i'm gonna go drop my packages i'll be back to do a video and probably the next hour on my other channel you said will smith okay and i'll see y'all later